YouTube friends, how are you today? It's a sunny Wednesday in Virginia, a little chilly. Well, it's 61, but it, I think it's chillier in the house than it is outside. Anyway, today I wanted to show you how I decorated my tear tray trays. I have two of them, um, you know, my big one and then that little tiny one in the kitchen. So we're going to go back to the kitchen again. I hope you're not tired of being in the kitchen, but come on and we'll check it out. Here is my larger two-tier tray. Um, it came from Target. It's from the Hearth and Hand collection. And I just sit it on a Lazy Susan just for the purposes of filming this. I don't keep it on that so I can just easily turn it around without making a lot of noise. So here is one side of the tray. I have my Happy Spring Ray Dunn mug and I just put it in a little um, grapevine wreath. And then down here, I have a little sign to the back. I think I got that at ooh, TJ Maxx maybe. And this little bunny. And this little doodah, I don't even know what it is. It's not Ray Dunn, but it kind of looks like Ray Dunn. And we're gonna swing it around. I'll show you this side. Now, this little sign right here, I got from the Walmart Easter section just a couple weeks ago. And I cut out that bunny rabbit from my Cricut machine. And I have this little bunny facing that bunny because he says, that's what I want to look like when I grow up. So that's the story on that. And then my terramoto balls and some eggs and chicks in there. But I don't know if you noticed, let me spin it back around again. On the opposite side of the sign, I cut a black vinyl bunny out just to have something on the back side of that sign. I'm learning to use my Cricut. I have a long way to go before I perfect it. But anyway, I'm trying. So down here on the bottom, I have the little bunny with the black polka dots, and just some greenery, and then a little um, daffodil laying there. So I think it turned out really cute. I'm getting better at doing tiered trays. Let me see if I can spin it around like this. This one was kind of fun to do, actually. There you go. Okay, then over here, I have this little um, tray that I got from the Target Bullseye Spot. And I just, I ordered these um, little signs from a company that Krista, Crystal Terra talked about on her channel. And it's called the White Ash Sign Company. And the signs are precious. And I'll show you the other signs that I got. I ordered this one for fall. And then a 4th of July, when they have so many, it's really hard to choose. And then this lemon one. And, <clears throat> excuse me, after I got these signs, I was so impressed with them, I ordered four more. So I ordered um, one for Christmas, one for winter, one for Valentine's. And I think I ordered one with bees on it, something about honeybees. So anyway, take a peek at those. If you order four... Well, it's at the amount, but four signs equal to free shipping. So that's why I did four. Anyway, here it is. And that Cottontail Farm sign, I think, is precious on this tear tray. And then down here, in front of it, I just set these little salt and pepper shakers that I got from Cracker Barrel a long time ago. And in that little watering can, I have that little kind of scary-looking Anna Lee mouse. You know, sometimes I look at them and think they're the quite ugliest things and then other times I think they're right cute and then I have a little green bunny back there and I didn't really there's an egg back there I didn't really do too much to decorate the back because it doesn't show but I think it looks really cute sitting there and I'm really really happy with this one so I appreciate you stopping by and I'm gonna do some closing words in just a minute 
Well, friends, that's all I have for you today. But before I let you go, I want to tell you about a channel, a channel that I discovered just by scrolling through. And I really was impressed with this channel and I thought that you might like it too. Um, the name of the channel is Cottage to Courtyard and the lady's name is Deborah. She is so talented and she I, I think she's just getting started in YouTube, but she you wouldn't know it. You would think she was a professional, but she decorates in French country and she does a lot of repurposing and chalk painting and all. But the thing that I is that she does um different vignettes she'll show you different vignettes she has a nice backdrop and puts them out on a table and she'll show you like three different vignettes where she has used basically the same items except maybe change up a few things like she'll she change up a plate and a glass to go with it and a napkin and then the next vignette she'll switch out and combine different um fabrics same vignette but different fabrics she's really good with fabrics and i believe she's a seamstress she talks about sewing and sewing for other people so i think she is a seamstress and she makes all her table runners and her pillows and she's just really great and i i really was impressed with her so i just wanted to share her channel with you because you know Sometimes there's nothing on TV and you need to just scroll around YouTube and see who's out there. So take a peek at her. And until next time, take care. Bye-bye.